Thank you for visiting my site. It's so great that you wanted to see how this look was done. It's very easy and you can use it for a day or evening look. And um, I want to make sure that you can see what I'm doing. So I'm going to go ahead and zoom in and then we'll get started. See you soon. Bye guys. Okay, so here we are. And I'm going to start off with a color called Blank Type. Um, it's just a light, um, almost white color but it's it has a little bit of yellow in it and it's a matte color and what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take a fluffy brush like this one and apply that all over the eye so just give it a good coat all right and then the next step is I'm going to be taking a color um, called All That Glitters and it's just like a shimmery bronze color and I'm going to be taking a flat brush like this one and just dipping it in the color and applying it to the eyelid a little bit more And I just go in the inner corner of the eye like that. Okay, now I'm going to go back to my fluffy brush. And I'm going to grab this color right here. It's called Scene. And it's a gray, but it has a little bit of blue in it. And again, with my fluffy brush, I'm going to take just a little bit of it and go all the way in the crease and it doesn't come out super heavy but it does define the crease really nicely so just going in the crease there and blending up now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use one of my favorite matte colors and it's called print and it's just um, like a deeper gray. Um, not, it's not too dark, um, but it's, it's pretty solidly gray. And I'm going to again take the fluffy brush, add color onto it, and I'm going to start by applying the print right here on the eye and then eventually blend it upwards. Um, about halfway into the crease. So again, laying it down on the corner of the eye and then blending it up and in about halfway into the crease. All right. Now, I'm going to be taking a color called Fig One and it's just a matte purple um, also by MAC, but just a matte purple that kind of looks like this. Not too dark, um, but not too, too light, otherwise it won't make any difference. And to help blend these colors together and just give it a little bit softer of a look, I'm going to take the purple and go in right here and blend it all together. And this will still give you a gray look, but now you just have a little hint of purple, and it's really, really beautiful when you add the purple in with the gray. All right. And again, I'm just kind of blending up towards this corner of my eyebrow. All right. And then I'm going to take my flat brush again and that all that glitters color and I'm just gonna put a little bit right here on the eye all right my next step is to take a black eye pencil and I'm gonna be using the makeup forever aqua eyes 
and I'm just going to take it and go over right on the lash line. And don't worry if it's messy because we're just going to smudge it like this. And you can use a brush to do this, but I just prefer to use my fingers. And just bringing it out just a little bit. And go ahead and go into the waterline as well. And then I'm going to go ahead and take my angled brush, just like this, and my print. And I'm just going to add a little bit of color right in the lash line. Now I'm not really pulling this all the way across. I'm just adding color where the lashes are. Alright, and I'm going to take just a little bit more and go on top and place it over the liner that I just put there. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a flat brush like this and I'm going to be using my Naked Palette by Urban Decay. And I'm going to be using this color right here called Hustle. And it's like a brown purple color and it's just really, really beautiful. So I'm going to take a little bit of that on this brush. And I'm going to add it right under the lashes right here. Just to give it a little bit of a smoky look. And then I'm going to do it right over the line that's on the lashes and I'm going to blend it up just a little bit into the crease. Okay, okay perfect. Alright, so now I'm going to put um, two or three coats of mascara and I'll be right back. Okay, and here I am. I have my mascara on now and you can see that the eye look is complete. Now, the only part of it that you're not able to see is what I did with the mouth, um, but I can show you the items that I used. So, I started off by using um, by NYX. It's called um, Natural and it's number 810. And I used that all over the mouth. Um, on the lip line and then filled in with that color and then right in the center I use number 858 and that's the nude pink also by NYX and I used that just in the center of the mouth and then I went in with a gloss and the gloss that I used was see-through by MAC and it's just a neutral gloss and I went ahead and I dabbed that in the center of the mouth and then just um, went ahead and spread it out just a little bit on the lips and it's really beautiful this is a great look um, I wear this look for every day all the time um, but for some people it might be a little heavy so you can use it um, as an evening look as well and it's super easy and fun and I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for visiting my site and remember stay cute bye guys uh, 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 uh.